The power of speak up, unpacking the phrase. Hello language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving deep into the phrase, speak up. If you've heard it before and wondered exactly what it means, or how and when to use it, you're in the right place. Speak up primarily has a very direct meaning, to speak louder or more clearly. For instance, if someone is talking too softly in a noisy environment, a person might say, can you speak up? I can't hear you. Interestingly, speak up also has a few figurative meanings. One, expressing an opinion or idea. If someone says, if anyone has a different idea, please speak up, they mean, please share your opinion or thought. Two, defending someone or something. You might hear it in contexts like, she spoke up for her friend when he was wrongly accused. This means she defended her friend or expressed support for him. In many cultures, speaking up, especially against authority or the majority, might be seen as disrespectful or inappropriate. However, in many Western cultures, especially in business or academic settings, speaking up is often encouraged. It's seen as a way to share fresh ideas, challenge old ones, or bring light to issues. When asking someone to speak louder, it's generally polite to add a please. Could you please speak up? If you're encouraging someone to share their opinion or defend someone, you can say, don't hesitate to speak up if you feel differently. Always be aware of the cultural context. In some situations or cultures, it might be better to approach things more indirectly rather than directly asking someone to speak up. We hope this breakdown of the phrase, speak up, has been enlightening. Language is a beautiful thing, and phrases like these, with their literal and figurative meanings, showcase its depth and richness. Keep exploring, keep questioning, and always remember to speak up in your journey of language learning.